Alright guys and girls, welcome back to Western Superman. We're in uh, the town and stuff with the beach area. Here with my mum. Uh, well, my mum's just here. So hello mum, she's eating her sandwich at the moment. Hi. From Greg. Uh, I said to my mum, I'll pay for us both to go in the aquarium just right behind us. The uh, Where they have like the sharks and stingrays and all that. See how much it is to go in there and all that. Uh, yeah, take some videos if they allow me to anyway, and all that. But anyway, back in a bit guys and girls, just watching this bit. Alright, here we go. Alright guys and girls, so we're at the, um, the Sea Life Centre, Western Superman, the aquarium area. Just looking in there, nice beautiful sort of habitat. Yeah, this is you can do videos in here and all that, so I'm going to take as much as I can till my actual film runs out. But yeah, we've got some little turtles here for you guys and girls. Little turtles, sea turtles, I suppose. Just sitting there, grumpy and miserable. That's me. And that there, that's my mum. <laughs> anyway, I'll back in a minute, guys and girls. So yeah, at the front of the entrance, this is the front of the entrance, guys and girls. We've got these like little fish tanks here, with these lovely little fish swimming around here. Look. So. Um, Spotted scat, and oh, I don't know if it's gonna need it to auto focus. There we go. Spotted haggis, and you can pause it at any time, guys and girls, just to have a look at it and all that. Just gonna be doing this in 4K and all that, so you get some good sort of shots. There we go. Automatically, look at that one there. Yeah, he's coming up to the little thing there. Look at that little fish. Anyway, I'm only going to do them a couple of seconds or a few minutes and all that per scene so I can get them all in. I've got my mum sitting there. Yeah. Say hello, mum. Hello. <laughs> anyway, I'll back in a minute, guys and girls. Alright, yeah, guys and girls, welcome back to another quick one. Just a little billboard here telling you about where the fish come from. Living fish uh, can be divided into three groups jawless fish, uh, cutter, large. Nias fish and bony fish so yeah it's pretty cool do pause it guys and girls for the information so you can see on here and if you enjoyed the video at the end of the uh, video do like favorite share comment and subscribe and i'll be right back in a minute all right guys and girls so simon we're at the western super mare uh, aquarium we're just looking in here we've got some goldfish in here massive huge ones but then again I think because of water it makes they make them um, look really huge so they've got different colours types uh, no I oh there's a little baby one there hello fella actually I don't even know if it is a fella I don't know if, how you can actually tell I suppose the bigger ones would have a bigger belly on them oh my god look at him or her or whatever there we go Oh, that's so cute. This is in 4K, by the way, guys and girls. So I'm going to be putting most of this in 4K. There we go. This is on the top. And we've got the sort of nice green sort of uh, foliage at the top there with the little rocks and all that. And we've got the stones and pebbles at the bottom there. Anyway, back in a minute, guys and girls. So this is actually, before I do go, in the next bit. So we've got some more here. Oh, my God. These are even bigger, I should have turned my mum around a minute. Look at the size of that, look. Yeah. That looks, what is these, cod or something? Actually, I wouldn't say it's cod. Thirsty work, it says at the top there. Uh -huh. Thirsty work. Yeah, so they can eat that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, phobia, facial fears. Ooh, I don't even know what these actually are. Let us know in the comments below, guys and girls, what these are. Look at that. Look at the size of that. Whoa, look at his face. He's looking at me, that one. He wants me for dinner. <laughs> anyway, so we've got this slight ones here. And this it goes into the sort of main area there. We've got the front entrance just round the corner there. Anyway, I'll back in a minute, guys. And go. All right, so I've got some more here. For you guys and girls, some more little sort of fish. Wow, look at that tropical fish. Look at his face, that one there. Look. Beautiful, 
something out of like Finding Nemo or something. And yes, guys and girls, I've watched Finding Nemo and it's fantastic film. So we've got all these ones here. If you like the quantity of the picture as well, do let us know in the comments below. Actually, these ones here as well, useful information. Do pause as well, so if you want to find the information and all that. If you want to have a look, if I'm a bit too quick, no flash photography, obviously. So, there you go. What's these ones? Uh, Madas Blenny. Askenias. Me does. Sounds um I don't know, it sounds like so oh there we go. Oh my god. One with googly eyes, eh look? You got some googly eyes. <laughs> That's on there. Look at that, whoa. And then there's a little sort of a water fall coming down. Uh, what we've got in there and thinking now. Oh wow. No idea what these ones are. My god, they look like sort of starfish type things, but with lovely little flappy wings. Look like butterfly fish. Anyway guys and girls. Then we've got these ones here. The containers. My god, I'm going to be running out of film before I've even got anyone. I might have to do some of this in 1080p, by the way, guys and girls, so I can get some stuff in there. Coral reefs. I'm oh, sorry about coral reefs. Discovery Trail. Back in a minute, guys. Alright, no, 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 no. guys and girls. Oh. So I'm just uh, uh, in the aquarium bit there out my god some big fish look at this nice little coloured so they've got nice like coloured backgrounds and stuff but look at this I don't know what this one is he's just lying in a sort of a pot no idea he looks like a sort of snake sort of fish and then you've got these ones oh my god I love the colour Love the colour. The colour just brings out the entire sort of thing. My god, he's a big one over there as well. Oh, look at that one. And then he got that one, he's got like sort of a horn on his head. He looks like one of those, um, what do you call it, uh, unicorns? With a unicorn. I'm going to call him a unicorn fish. And then we've got him, he looks a bit grumpy. Look. But he's got like, oh my god, they look like they've got human faces, really. Oh. Some of these ones. They look so human-like. Uh, there he goes. There's the one there, look. Do, 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 do. And then we've got him. Oh, hello, fella. Oh, he wants to get in there, look. <laughs> oh, it's quite cool. I like this. Anyway, guys and girls, I'll be back in a quick uh, sort of a talk through. Yeah, right, guys and girls, quickly, just to show you this little jellyfish in 4K there. Here we go, there we go. Oh, that looks so nice, look. Wow. And they actually um, can actually go back into a baby and then rebirth itself. So that's where it can basically re become reborn and all that. So it looks quite cool. Look at that, just awesome. So they don't really die, really. They just reborn, reincarnate, and all that. Look at how I changed the colours. Look, wow, it's just beautiful, beautiful. Anyway, guys and girls, back in a minute. Yeah, right, guys and girls, welcome back to another video of mine. We have a stingray in here now. Uh, so yeah, a sort of a tailed. One by the looks of it. But yeah. Looks quite cool. Uh, it says there, uh, please do not touch the fish. They don't want people touching the fish <laughs> and all that. So yeah. Anyway, guys and girls, back in a bit of the piranhas. Yeah, right, guys and girls, welcome back 
to another video, uh, which I'm going to be connecting onto the same video. We've got some piranhas there for you in this one. And yeah, this is actually, this camera on this phone is pretty cool because it picks up really good sort of vibes that's of the same color as the area. So, because it's HDR, so it gives you that realism of uh, the environment. But as you can see, some nice, apparently they're piranhas, uh, piranha fish. Uh, like sharks, they can detect tiny amounts of blood in the water, so can find injured animals or fish easily. Uh, although they have a nasty bite, they rarely attack humans, only when the water is low and food is scarce, do they become threat to the local fishermen. So that's all the sort of main sort of things on it so that's the the piranhas there oh, there we go there's all the piranhas anyway guys and girls i'll back in a minute and then we'll get going because this is the last bit all right guys and girls so this is the last bit of the tour bit uh just having a look quick look i'm trying to see if there's any sharks because there's supposed to be some sharks in here but we've got a stingray not too sure what breed of stingray but look it's a little little oxygen i believe that's his oxygen now uh, let me see if i can focus on that there we go can we focus a little bit it's not focusing really actually because i think that's because of this yeah this is only a short word it's only a small place i suppose it's because they haven't well they've got a load of fish uh this only cost me like eight quid because um, my mum's disabled and she's in the wheelchair and all that so because they said carers go free so I'm looking after my mum as well so so that's pretty cool and anyway, there's the little fish here look there's the little fellas trying to get a little view in there oh look at that nice they look like um, I don't know is it carp or something I remember I used to go fishing with my dad and all that back in the days and stuff when uh, used to do fishing and all that, and yeah, it's just amazing. My God, I'm just trying. I know you could, you cut um, getting those little tigglers. Yeah. Oh, what is that? What is that massive? Is that a massive shark? I don't know. I don't actually know. I think was that a heel? It might be a heel. I I haven't studied in fish for a long time so and now they've got these different breeds of fish out there and all of that i'll do this one as a quick five minute one the uh and this one's only kind of so i'm just going to see if there's any sharks in there i mean you've got a stingray just long there i know that's a stingray oh is this is that a shark is that a catfish shark or something i don't know let us know in the comments below, guys and girls, if you know about your fish. Actually, there we go. And I had it zoomed out, and that's why it's not focusing that great on me. Focusing and all that. Um, yeah, that's pretty cool. Wow. Nice little things. Wow. Nice little fish and all that. I was trying to see which is the sharks and which are the fish and all that. These are rays. This is thornback ray. Oh, a thornback, is it? A thornback ray, because you see all of her tail, she's got those thorns. Ah, okay. And that's a place to move past. Uh, oh, you should go over the tunnel. You should go over the tunnel. Uh, that's cool. So there's no eyes underneath him, it's all on top of his head. Yeah, I noticed those little googly ones there, uh, fish down the bottom just right here. Oh, that's the sharks, is it? It's very smooth hand. Uh, it's quite cool. I remember I used to do fishing back in the days with my dad and all that, but I've turned vegan now, so I don't <laughs> like going around killing things. Yeah, yeah, my dad passed away as well, so. Uh, that was back in 2005, so it's been gone for a while now. I'm just going to put some food in the clownfish if you want to watch them get some dinner. Oh, yeah, that'd be quite cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's cool. Oh. It's a cancer, isn't it? Oh, that's a big fish. Asian I suppose. Arowana. Oh, was it? Asian arowana. Ah, that's cool. 
What part is it? Asia, is it um, from them? Yeah, they're from uh, China, and, China. Uh, and that place. Uh, could be endangered because they're beautiful and everyone wants them in the pet industry. Yeah. I mean, how many places has got them at the moment? Is it just the uh, western we, one? Or? Uh, Bristol Zoo's got a couple, I think. Uh, Bristol, Still, yeah. I haven't seen for a few years, but I know they had a couple of animals there. That's cool. Feeding them well then, that one, he's got a bit like chubby and all of that one. Yeah, he gets given different things, he gets given insects, he does. So ah, insects, yeah. And all the little fish get little bits of food. Yeah, which is um, the actual fish that eat prawns, because I noticed there's fish that eat prawns, don't they, technically? Or... Oh, there's some fish that eat all sorts. All sorts. Uh, yeah. Just crustaceans in general. Yeah. So, it has got a bit of a shell that you can chew on and they like that. Just like us and the humans, just fussy eaters. <laughs> oh. Because I've noticed as well, when you put fish in the water, they actually look a lot bigger. I think because it gives it that sort of magnifying yeah. sort of thing. Oh, you too as well. Cheers, thank you. Ah, that's cool. Alright. So this is in 4K as well, guys and girls. Some of it um, would probably be 1080p, but most of the videos here are actually uh, 4K. Oh, look at his face, look. Look at his face, hey, he's got a grumpy face on him, look, grumpy. I like his, like, sort of orange coat that he's got on him. He's like, sort of, uh, I don't know what you actually call it, actually, it's, I suppose his coating and all that. And then you've got these, like, little fish here as well. It's quite cool that you can mix different fish and with each other. I think he's by the looks of it. I don't know if this is open water fish. Uh, so it's about lakes, uh, a Malawi fish over there as well. They've got like a, this is another bit of the place um, over there, just like bits and bobs. Giant river rays as well. They've got some information there as well. Some stem rays grow up to two meters in size. Uh, yeah, do. Um, like pause it if you find these interesting guys and girls and there's my mum getting a bit miserable because she wants to get going already spoiled sport aren't you hey? no, not. yeah you are it's because you want another one of your sandwiches you just bought from Greg cause that's no, what it is not. yeah <laughs> it's funny, hey hey what do you mean you bought was it four of those long sandwiches how dare you <laughs> Anyway, guys and girls, um, I'm going to finish off here. Hopefully it focuses. I'm hoping it focuses. But, uh, yeah, they've got the... That's the tunnel just here behind me. Uh, well, actually, not tunnel here. That's, I suppose that's the um, stuff like around here. I'm afraid I'm going a bit too fast for you guys. I do apologise. Uh, and then you've got to like little sort of stuff on about corals and all that more eels i suppose secret i want to try the one out in bristol as well at some point but that's the tunnel just way right down there the one i just came to just a minute ago and you've got these little blue oh my god look at these guys and girls these little blue colored sort of fish that looks lovely look beautiful little thing might have to get some of these when i get a fish tank at some point I don't know if you can get these, I suppose these are like sort of tropical or maybe fresh water. And then they, oh what, Lily Thatcher, what? Clownfish. Actually I don't know if you can see that, see if I can focus that. Uh, special thing, I was just like thanks to, to do the clownfish and all that kind of stuff. I suppose the ones who give them it and all that, the fish. Or donate the fish to them. Anyway, guys and girls, we've got like little common clownfish, then you have your black and white clownfish, then you've got your peculiar clownfish, and then you've got a regal tan. So, different ones. Anyway, I'm going to finish off because I'm running out of tape. Cheers all for watching, guys and girls. Stay safe and have a good one. Yeah, we did come in here, uh, even in here. Yeah, right, guys and girls, welcome back. Um, so I've just come out of there, um, out of the Sea Life Centre, or Sea Aquarium, 
that's what it's called, Sea Aquarium. Uh, so we just, there we go, Sea Life Center area, like all Sea Aquarium. Western Supermare, absolutely fantastic in there. Very warm and welcoming in there as well, the people in there are just lovely. Um, so yeah, um, I'm going to finish off this episode here. If you enjoyed we the episode, yeah, yeah well, I'm, well, my mum reckons we missed some of them and all that, but I don't think we actually did. Um, but well, there's some some in there. But if I did, I'll probably do come back next time when I do a second sort of like um, video, um, and I'll do another one. Also, I wanted to go to the one up in Bristol at some point because I think they've got a bigger one down there, and uh, yeah, it'd just be fantastic oh, I and all. Uh, yeah, my mum reckons to do it in the summer and all that because it is a bit chilly today and a bit cold, so we can't really do it today, obviously. But we've got the uh, pier over there as well, guys and girls. Uh, you'll see how on, where is it? Where is it? Got the Western Pier over there as well. And we did come out a bit late. At the time of this, uh, it's 4.10, Thursday the 15th of February. 2018 I've been Anthony Kenneth Bishop and you've been watching the Anthony Kenneth Bishop uh, channel cheers all for watching stay safe and have a good one guys and girls and say goodbye mum bye